My name is Anab Adam Gulet. I'm originally from Somalia. I grew up in Hargeisa, which is in the northwestern region of Somalia, and is the second largest city in the country after Mogadishu. I'm the youngest of 11. Due to civil war, my mother, sister, and five of her children left Somalia and migrated to Toronto in late 1990. I went to school, high school, and college, and I got married shortly after. My husband was a U.S. citizen, and I was a Canadian citizen at the time, but decided to move to U.S. After a brief stay in Chicago, we made Minnesota our home, and I have four children, two sons, and two daughters. Even though most of my early experiences as a newcomer occurred in Toronto, Canada, like learning new language, getting used to the cold, and so on, still, there were some things I had to get used to in migrating to Minnesota. Here, I started driving. I had to get used to that. Toronto has a very efficient transit system. I took the bus and the train all the time. But at the same time, during those years, I was primarily a student, so it made sense for me to hop on the bus and the train. I noticed that the weather is a bit different here. Here, it seems to snow more. It also rains heavily. I think in my 10 years of living in Toronto, we only had one major winter storm. In Minnesota, we're famous for our snow. Living in Toronto was a bit more multicultural. Taking the train was like United Nations. Here, I had to get used to Minnesota population, which is less multicultural. In fact, according to the latest government estimate, as of 2013, Minnesota population was 86% white. The healthcare system was different too. It took me a while to understand the U.S. healthcare system. Canada has a universal healthcare system. I had a health card from Health Canada, and I presented that wherever I went. With that, I didn't deal with deductions, copay, health plans, in and out of network, and all the other layers that's built into having access to health coverage. Even after more than a decade of living in Minnesota, I'm still learning Minnesota ways. Like, what interesting means. Is it a polite way of saying I don't like something? One thing I can say is that Minnesota is a great state to live in, work, and raise family. In all the cities I lived thus far, I found Minnesota to have a great parks, recreational places to take your kids to, great schools, and great neighborhoods. My boys play soccer, and Minnesota is known for having a nice soccer field. I have a great job, colleagues, and active, vibrant Somali and non-Somali friends that I can rely on when I need to chat and socialize. That's my story.